So we're in Colby at the bottom of Balakilferic Road and we're here because hundreds of years ago there was a fair held here and it was called St Catherine's Fair and the field we're standing in now is still called the Fairfield. They would celebrate the start of the summer with Lair Column Kilia and six months later when we get to winter and all of the producers gathered in and they've had their harvests they would celebrate again the start of the winter at the end of November, start of December. Some people say that the fair started with a procession. Some men from the village killed a hen and walked through the fair field two by two, carrying the hen between them, singing, Catherine's hen is dead. They would then go to the pub, which I assume would be Bell Abbey Chapel, now a house, but it was originally built as a pub. And they would hold a wake for the hen. After they held the wake for the hen, the next day, they would go back and bury the head, bury the feet, keep some of the feathers for good luck, but they would then cook the body and have a feast. If anyone was found to be drunk after the fair and after the going to the pub, they were said to have plucked a feather from the hen. Another story is that in the days before there were lawyers and advocates, the people of the village would solve any arguments or disagreements before Lael Katrina. So they decided to pluck feathers from the hen and they buried the feathers under the ground and the argument was all agreed between them then. They just carried on and they were all happy. It was symbolic, I suppose. Carrying the hen would be seen as putting all their arguments behind them. So when they were burying everything in the ground, it was all sorted out. Kia Katrina Maru, Kia Katrina Maru, Gauza Kionas Goims Nafkazan as Vimuji Fo and Talu.